Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play Bioshock Infinite, part 21. And this one, we're gonna keep exploring here and try to find Mr. Uh, uh, Mr. Chen Lin, I think his name is. I thought he looked familiar. Hey, uh... Well... We were trying to keep an eye out for you. Too soon. That was way too soon. Let's, let's get out of here. Oh, uh... Strange noises. Not creepy at all hearing strange noises when you're, you know, exploring a prison. Can you unlock this? I'll give it a whirl. It's done. Okay. Got some gear here. Executioner. Yeah, we'll take it. No, the mayor out. So we're gonna be stuck in prison. I've learned one thing in my life: it's that you don't want to be stuck in prison. You went to prison, wait? No, I didn't. This open. Looks simple enough. It's a hairpin lock. This of course, it, it's simple. It? All right. Is there nothing in here lockpick wise to replace my lockpicks? Well, that's stinky. Do it. You're a liar. But you can't blame me for looking after my own interests, can you? Now I know Fitzroy has come calling, but I think you'll find your business with her has come to an end. <laughs> Lions walk with lions, DeWitt! Not hyenas! Uh, what does that mean? Can't see anything. Probably not meant to see anything. This is bad. What we're about to walk into, it's bad. Bad's not good. That's not fish. That's human blood. Oh my. Are we, uh... Oh. Well, let's, um... Mr. Uh... Chenlin? Now we need to find someone else to make those guns. No. Dead is dead, Elizabeth. Dead is dead. What? Oh no. The hell did I see heads. And I see tails. It's all a matter of perspective. Why are you following us? Who sent you? Comstock? What do you want? What do you see here from this angle? Dead. Listen. And that angle? Alive. Walker. Chen Lin. The body's gone. It was never here. What? It's another Columbia. A different Columbia. The same coin. A different perspective. Heads. Tails. Dead. Alive. We have to go through to this other Columbia. What? How? It's like riding a bicycle. One never really forgets. One just needs the courage to climb aboard. If we go into this tower, I don't think able to bring us back. Are you sure you're ready? To tear or not to tear, that is the question. Um Yeah. Okay, open it. Let's tear into it, I guess. Look. There's no blood. And no 
body. It's another world. What is this? Let's give it a shot. Something tells me one dead gunsmith ain't the only thing that's changed. Okay. Well, we got another gun to try out. At least we, uh... You know, risked our lives and died for... Hey, guys. Uh... Hey look, it's Slate. Only not. Wait, everyone with an eye patch isn't Slate. Yes it is! You guys are silly. Oh, the crime board. Um, murder. Minus three. Total. Plus 32. What is Total? It's supposed to be say Total? Because that's definitely Total. I don't know. You guys can look at the crime board if you want. I'm too busy being a good citizen and killing guards. What? <laughs> We're in a different tear with that body still here? That guy's not having a good day. Open. Slay, buddy! Homie, my main man. Looks like you're still having a bad time. So what in the world changed here other than the fact that there's some like prisoners now? And weird crap falling from the sky. Huh. Okay. I don't understand how Chen Lin is alive now. We're in a world where he was never murdered. Somewhere we'll find out why, I suppose. I don't suspect you can change something like that and have everything else remain the same. So we're in some kind of like... Is this like some kind of logic game where there's all these possible worlds and the terrors can take you to any of these possible worlds? Is that is that what's going on? These men. I killed them. They were dead. Not in this world. What are they in this world? Slow to shoot compared to the machine gun. Next. That man you just fought. In the other world, he was the one who was struck up on the wall. In the other world? This whole business makes my head hurt. You're not the only one. I'm trying to think ahead as to what the heck's going on here. If you guys do know, don't tell me. Okay, catch. Got it. Which one's the one that was strung up on a wall? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what to explore, what's already explored, what we need to re-explore. Which way's up and which way's left? I'm... I'm a little confused. And apparently I've got the burps. I know, that's There's rude. Where? Where? Didn't mean to take those out. Ooh, lockpick. Thank you. 
Okay, well, I'm glad we came back in here after all. But for the bare necessities. Yeah. We'll buy one of those. Okay. Give me money. Cause there's more salt. Well, we got a code book. Is the code book applicable in this world, but not in the last? So now we need to find the code. Bronco aid. Eh, I want to save our money. I found some money. Want it? Yeah. <laughs> Appreciate it. I want money. What are you looking at? Okay, let's go over here. So we can find some kind of code. Okay. Thank goodness Father Washington isn't back. That would have sucked. Anything under the stairs? No. Alright. Keep on keeping on. Hello, Mr. Fink. See, he thinks he's a bull or a bear or a hyena or something. Or a lion. I don't know what he called himself. I think he called himself a lion. But he wasn't counting on Elizabeth's powers. And by Elizabeth's powers, I mean mine. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> there another door over here? Yeah. Huh, what? Don't just say, huh. If you got something to say, share it with the class. Never try this one. So we'll try this next. The Bucking Bronco. Anything from here? Uh, carbine, RPG, pistol, spread. Oh, uh, nothing for the gun we're using. All right. Here's some cash. Cash. Money. Thanks. Wow, that, was a, that, was a, that was a very expensive coin. Money. Nothing. Money. Don't want the shotgun. Alright. Let's get out of here. Alright, we're gonna take one quick look around because we found that code book. And I want to make sure it's not in here. And I'm kind of getting close to the end of this episode, and I don't really want to go out and start something new. So. Let's see what we can find. Anything. Anything related to the codes. Because I really don't want to miss out on it, but I'm not seeing anything that looks code like. Nothing, nothing. Interesting. What? What's interesting? What? Ooh, lockpick. That was a good find. Wait, we've been screaming at you for hours about that. Well, Elizabeth pointed it out. You did. What? What? Oh. Maybe. I don't know. Keep on keeping on. I thought that was a birthday cake. It was a health bag. Better a health bag than a scumbag. <laughs> like you? Don't call me names. I gotta sneeze. Ah, <coughs> oh, pardon me. Oh, what? Oh, what? 
Let's take a look at this. I don't think we looked at this one. First Lady, William R. Foreman. Okay. Oh, okay, the blimp. We need that blimp! Well, that was fascinating. I'm really glad that was not a waste of time. More lockpicks. Man, I suck at finding things the first three times around. Same poster. Money. Health full. Finest Vigors. Bucking Bronco. That bucking Bronco is getting on my nerves. Gosh darn that bucking Bronco. <laughs> what a buck that was. Oh, that's not creepy at all. Why do you think so creepy? Why are you so creepy? So creepy. So creepy. Free sample. Yeah. No, we don't want cigarettes. We are better than that. No, we don't need any gin. Hey, Bob! We got some gin for you. Bob? Bob. Bob. More money. Take it. Oh well. Bob didn't want his gin. That'll do. I can just run here and get like infinite money from Elizabeth apparently. Alright, well I don't see anything with the codes. So Why no pick up ammo? Oh well. Whoa! What the? A jitterbug! A jitterbug! You put the boom boom into my brain! And then you dance, 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 do your feet do the same! A jitterbug! Alright, we're done. What the? Alright, well we're going to head back up to the front and we're going to end this one, guys. If I can never find the front again. Alright, well thank you guys so much for watching. This has been Let's Play Bioshock Infinite, part 21. Stay tuned for part 22 where we're apparently going to look for the undead gunsmith. So, um, this might be the last episode I get recorded before I go to Chicago for a few days. Hopefully it gets posted on time like I want it to. So this should be up by maybe like, I don't know, Tuesday? Tuesday, I think? Alright, well, stay tuned for part 22. Until next time, see ya!